I, I uh, preached a sermon one time on our churches in the city, and one of my goals is to uh, help people from the city come to the church and help people from the church move into the city, in the poorer parts of the city. So I'm holding forth about 15 years ago on this and pleading with people to move to where it's dangerous. Come on, move away from comfort toward need, not away from need toward comfort. What kind of people are you anyway? You know? And, uh, and the wife of one of our, our staff came up to me. and she had, they, they lived in the city and had just recently moved there. And she had tears running down her cheek. And she said, well, I hear what you say, but I'm just so afraid when I hear a gunshot or I hear some scream in the middle of the night. And I said to her, fear not. You can only be killed. <laughs> she, didn't, she didn't laugh. That is a direct paraphrase of verse 28, is it not? Let's read it again. Do not fear those who kill the body, but can't touch the soul. Fear not, you can only be killed. That's what I'm out to produce in my preaching ministry is people that say, fear not, I can only be killed. I carry on an email dialogue with a, a young woman whose husband is Arabic. And several times a year, on a certain kind of visa, he goes to a North African, absolutely so-called closed country and ministers to a secret group of saints and gets arrested almost every time, was tortured the last time, and she knows one of these times he will not come home. And they plan their lives that way. She knows he will die doing this. That's what I'm after. What are you preaching for? You know, I, 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 I'll just be a little bit controversial here. This campus is very posh in my estimation of things. Everything is nice on this campus. And the chapel is nice, this room is nice, everything's nice here. And people dress nice here, and there are curtains here, and there are big pictures here, and, and there's air conditioning here, and there's lights here. This is a dangerous place to go to seminary. And I'm sending everybody I can here, just to make sure to get the balance here. <laughs> this is a dangerous place to go to seminary because Everything is so nice. If you get used to this niceness, you're going to be useless to breed this kind of people. So don't get used to it. This is a foretaste of heaven that is so incredibly dangerous that you'll never go back to the city. Or you'll never go to North Africa. You'll never go where it's hard. And the faculty have to live here. Pray for them. Good night. Danger is huge. It is hard for a rich man to get into the kingdom of heaven. You, this, is, this place is founded by rich people. It's obvious their money is everywhere. And it's dangerous. Not impossible. Not impossible, but it's dangerous. So uh, that's a little parenthesis to sound the warning that you need to preach and beget the kind of people who say, all you do is kill me. I'm going. That's reason number three.